Today we're gonna take a look at the latest update in Photoshop beta. As a reference, I'm gonna use this call, of course generated in mid-journey, and we're gonna mix it up with the AI from Photoshop. We got a new tool going on, which is located right here under the image. You can select subject, remove background, and you got a couple of few options. But there's a new thing you can do. I'm gonna select the lasso tool, and I'm gonna put some flowers into the eyes of the skull or above the skull. Actually, I'm gonna try it out like this so I'm gonna select this area and we got this button here generate a fill click on it and here you can type in whatever you want and I'm gonna go with insert a purple flower on the eye of the skull and I'm gonna click on generate oh wow check this out it came out perfectly it actually came out better than I expected and you can go also to the right we got at the properties panel here and as you can see we got three options actually so I can switch up and choose the one that I like most so I gotta go with the first one and you also can generate new versions from the first version so I'm gonna try to generate a couple of more and we got three more options that I don't like that much, but check this out. This actually came out really nice. We got two options that look really good. I'm going to go with this version. Next, I'm going to change up the teeth. I'm going to type in teeth made of gold. Occasionally it's going to show up this message, but I'm going to click on generating. And after a couple of tries, it's going to work. All right, we got some results and we're going to switch it up here. I also had normal teeth here and yeah, not that bad. And not but least, I'm going to add a crown on his head. I'm going to go like this, add a golden crown, decorate it with florals. Oh wow, look at that. You also have these two arrows. If you go forward, it's gonna switch up the crown and you can choose which one you like. And of course, if you don't like one of these, you got also these thumb down and thumbs up. So I don't like this one. And this way the AI is learning what is good and what is bad. And this is how you work with the new generative fill in Photoshop beta. Thanks for watching.